What happened to girl power? Australia's national women's soccer team the Matildas lose 7-0 to an under-15s boys side. By Cameron Phelps, for Daily Mail Australia. Australia's national women's soccer team have suffered a devastating defeat in the lead-up to the Rio Olympics, going down 7-0 to the Newcastle Jets under-15 boys side. What is particularly concerning for the Matildas is that despite resting some regulars, they were still able to field experienced international stars including former Ray FC Player of the Year Katrina Gorry. Despite the embarrassing defeat on Wednesday night at Valentine Sports Park in Newcastle, the Australian team will travel to Brazil as one of the gold medal favourites. To be honest we didn't expect that, Eggman told the Huffington Post Australia. The Jets boys were very good, all credit to them. They moved the ball around very well and were excellent all night. Eggman said that the Matildas are often forced to play against boys teams as trying to find quality female opposition can be difficult. It may not be the first time that the Australian team have suffered a heavy defeat against schoolboys with claims that they were smashed by an under-16 Sydney FC team last year circulating. The social media reaction to the defeat has been condemning with many claiming that the result is not good enough for a team that is expected to challenge for a medal at the Olympics. In the 2015 Women's World Cup in Canada, the team reached the quarter-finals, losing to eventual winners Japan. They will be hoping for a marked improvement when they kick off their official pre-Olympic friendlies with New Zealand in June. The Matildas are Australia's only hope for a football medal at the Rio Games after the men failed to qualify following a scoreless draw with Qatar in January.